now we want to see how we can uh, add email DNS such as MX records TX records and so forth so again I'll select the domain name I'm working on go to actions go to DNS settings so in my case I will be under um, in my panel that is on my cyber panel I'll be using a mail server okay, I want to create also a mail server for this case so that I may host my own mail services so to add all the records I'll first need to add several records mailing records so the first record I'll need to add I'll need to add um, a subdomain here called mail and then it will be a record and then the IP address this is the IP address okay which is good and then I need to add a new record again this one will be webmail webmail it's also an a record that's the IP address and afterwards I need to save it click save and I've saved it again so now I want to add different Different records. I want to add different records. Uh, mail records. I want to add um, MX records. Click on MX records here. So I want to add this record, the MX record. I'll go back to my domain manager, Dynadot. Click on Actions, DNS settings. In this case, I need to add several records. So what records do we have? Let's see. So this one MX is being added to the root of the domain. So this is Josh WP. So this is the root, the, the upper section of uh, DNS manager at Dynador. So I'll show you where that is. So this is the upper section. So this one, it will be added here. It's an MX record. Click on MX record. The priority, as you can see, here, we have a priority of 10. And then this is the value. So I'll go back. Priority is 10. And then the host, which is the value, it's mail joshwp.shop. Okay. And then I want to save it. Let's see what we have. And I've saved it successfully. Okay. That's successfully. So we want to add, add that records uh, for the mail server. For the mail server, we need more records, which include the. Um, text records so for this case we'll, I'll show you how to add text records TX TXT so click on TXT and then these are the records we need to add okay so we can see the first um, uh, TXT record is added we are going to add it directly to the root domain so this is the root which is at at okay in other domain uh, managers you will see an at sign so oh you had an at sign so this one is going to be added at the root and then these others are going to be added at subdomain level so we're going to start with the first one the value is that's the value just copy the value after copying the value go to dns manager at uh, dynadot select your uh, domain name the action you want to take and then you want to click on dns settings and now i've said this one is a tx record which is going to be added at the root this section here we said we had the root at root here so here i'll be adding uh, its tx record and then the value that's the value okay and then uh, uh, before i save let me just add all the rest and then this one is a dmx okay you see everything that comes before your domain name is called a subdomain so we have this subdomain going to copy that subdomain under domain manager we are uh, want to have that there that's the subdomain the type is text record and then we want to see what's the value this is the value you have that value go back to records uh, that one there and then I want to add a new record we had all of them okay so uh -huh. this one is a domain key okay domain key copy domain key want to add domain key here and then this one is a text record 
and then we want to see what's the value of the main key this is the value of our domain key copy it and make sure to paste it at the right place and lastly we have our default domain key so this is the subdomain and then we want to paste it there it's a tx record and then the value it's a huge one copy all of the double click or just um click on control a to select everything the control c to copy and then you want to paste it here and then you want to remove this um let me show you you want to remove uh, the quotation marks okay make sure to remove all the quotation marks they're not needed okay remove so this one remove this other quotation okay, it's a long key so also remove this one then remove also this and also remove that it's, it, sometimes it may work but most cases I've realized it doesn't work with the quotation marks you have to remove them and then now everything is good to go see the time to life is just we are it is set to five minutes and uh, sometimes it can take up to 48 hours for dns to be properly propagated but everything now is good we have added all the mail records we needed for our mail server not everybody will need this for the mail server so if you're using uh, your own you are hosting your own mail then you'll need to add all these records so now i can click save settings and then they will go live and that's it so we have successfully added all the records we needed you can just go back to actions dns records and then you can still check your records you can see we have a record mx records we have added every record we needed in this case and that's it thank you for watching see you next time